Pulse News on the Go, brought to you by Bell Aqua Mineral Water, proudly Ghanaian. The Supreme Court has ruled that the High Court should stop proceedings of the case by the incumbent member of Parliament for the Clotikole constituency, Ni Amashite, challenging the candidature of NDC parliamentary nominee for the constituency, Dr. Zanito Rollins. In a 4-1 majority decision, the Supreme Court said the High Court judge erred in his interpretation of Article 94 Clause 1A of the Constitution. Director of Public Affairs of the Ghana Police Service, Sefas Atta, says the police is ready to battle information technology firm Watergate Ghana Limited in court over the 25 million city suit arising out of the police online recruitment exercise. According to Sefas Atha, the online recruitment exercise wasn't done by any IT firm but by their own IT personnel in the police service. A new Refugees Welcome Index has placed Ghana 14 out of 27 countries where people would welcome refugees with open arms. The index is based on a global survey of more than 27,000 people carried out by the internationally renowned strategy consultancy Globescan. Released today by Amnesty International, the survey shows people say they are willing to go to astonishing lengths to make refugees welcome. The crash of an Egypt air flight en route to Cairo from Paris was more likely caused by a terrorist attack than by a technical failure, Egypt's aviation minister says. Minister Sharif Fathi discussed the crash even as the search operation continued in the Mediterranean for wreckage from the plane, which had 66 people aboard when it disappeared from radar on Thursday. Pulse News on the Go, brought to you by Bel Aqua Mineral Water, proudly Ghanaian.